Hey everyone, Tim with Collect Jurassic, checking out something a little bit different today, but still Mattel toy related. The Jurassic World Play app, uh, formerly called the Jurassic World Facts app, is Mattel's kind of toy accessory app. Just got updated for Epic Evolution, has all the new toys in there, but also has a new game that I really want to check out because uh, it's a certain type of game that I love. Here it is, you can see the little preview here. Um, it's an Endless Runner. I love Endless Runners, so if you load up this app, you'll see the Ride and Rampage uh, game. So there's some other games here that I was never too fond of, uh, which is why I never made a video, but this Ride and Rampage game is super fun. So let me go ahead and take you through it here. The game starts off with a little bit of a tutorial kind of teaching you how to play. You can see there's three lanes here uh, with obstacles and it kind of trains you on how to um, kind of move around the obstacle. <laughs> So it shows you how you can run into them, um, but also um, move around them. And then you start collecting these little tokens. Oh, and there's uh, actual like toy versions or live versions of Mattel toys to kind of, there's a Pyroraptor to kind of um, move around while you collect these coins. And if you can notice, I'm moving ever so slightly faster too, which makes the game a little bit harder uh, as you continue on. Um, oh, and there's a Neovenator. So it's kind of cool. Uh, this game, again, on top of being sort of uh, difficulty-based, sort of scaling up, it's also showing you little previews of the of the dinosaurs here. You got to jump over some obstacles. So kind of get the idea here. You're moving left and right. You're ducking. You're uh, yeah. Here's a, a duck. Um, you're jumping, and it just gets faster and faster. There's more obstacles. There's more dinosaurs, right? Um, and you just have to keep getting these tokens because once you do get enough tokens, you get to go into the uh, Allosaurus Rampage mode, which is a lot of fun. So, um, yeah, I mean, hopefully you can get a sort of an appreciation of how the game is going faster and faster. And I'm just kind of dodging these things. Um, it seems easy at first, but trust me, once it really gets going, uh, it's quite hard to uh, not hit anything. Um, but I also, I love these games. I've been playing them, you know, probably since they came out on, on phones. Um, so I'm kind of, I mean, I kind of understand the, how to, I guess, be somewhat good at them. So here, we're about to get the Allosaurus. So a uh, game will prompt you that you have enough coins to hit that. So, or tokens rather. So once we hit that, nice little animation of Allosaurus running. And now we are smashing. So we're literally, there's no obstacle. The Allosaurus can't just, you know, essentially smash right through. As you can see, I'm just literally um, crushing through all these trailers. Um, and then now the game, like, basically, uh, tutorial's over. I got my, my hearts now. There's no messing up. This is the, the real deal. So let's see how far we can get. I'd love to get... Um, you can see I'm collecting little kind of unlock keys, which, um, on top of letting you play as the Allosaurus, uh, there's also another part of this game where you can unlock dinosaurs um, from crates. So, assuming I can get, um, let's try to get up about a thousand or so coins. Oh, and little power-ups too, that's kind of cool. So these power-ups, uh, there's a, they do a couple different things. This one lets you instantly become an Allosaurus, right? So, there's that. I think there's a um, double token, so you can collect twice as many tokens. Um, I think there's a magnet too that lets you pick them up without having to like actually drive over them. So I'll see if I can get another one of those power-ups. Whoa, got a wild roar there. Um, you can see it's getting a little faster. Oh, there's the magnet. So now I have the magnet, which basically lets me pick things up without even having to drive next to them, which is, you know, makes it a little less stressful. Um, when you're trying to collect these things, um, but you can just see yeah, more dinosaurs coming out. Interesting though, it's literally just the new um, kind of 2024 dinosaur toys. They're not showing anything from Dino Trackers or Dominion. It's literally just the Epic Evolution figure. So oh, it looks like I have Allosaurus I can use again. Let me just get this power up. Um, all right, here we go. So yeah, I think I'm I'm making great progress toward a thousand tokens, um, and the game is moving faster and faster. I mean, look how fast Allosaurus is running through these crates. Pretty pretty crazy. Um, one thing I want to also kind of point out is the sort of deserty background here. I wonder if what that is inspired by, if that's anything to do with the new Netflix show, or if it's just random. Um, it's kind of interesting, though, that you know, Allosaurus is so prominently featured this year in the toy line, then we have this game about it, and it's in the desert, or at least some sort of deserty, sandy place. I don't know. Maybe I'm reading too much into it, but um, all right, another power up here. See, this is the double coin. So now you can see I'm really getting a lot of coins. Um, 
trying not to hit stuff too, but I have plenty of, uh, I'm getting there to a thousand, so this is looking good. And I also have another Allosaurus I can activate, so it would be kind of cool if they let you be different dinosaurs, but again, I, I think there's a, I think there's something to be kind of picked up on the fact that Allosaurus is such a key part of the Toyland this year, and it gets this, this awesome game, but I mean, yeah, I just love Endless Runners. Like I said, the other games that the Jurassic World Facts, now called Jurassic World Play App, the other games that it has um, aren't really fun. They're a little clunky, but this one plays pretty smoothly, and uh, it's kind of a fun challenge. I mean, look how fast I'm going now. Um, doing really well. I'm on a real roll here. Yeah, I'm really flying through this. I almost don't even need to move Allosaurus around because I'll just get enough points just running straight through, but um, I still got three hearts, so... Um, as things really speed up here, we'll see if I can hang on to all my all my life here. You only get three chances before you have to start. Oh, see, there we go. All right, well, um, we'll see if I can hold on to these uh, these other two hearts. But again, things are moving pretty fast here. Lots of um, you know, moving. Oh yeah, Whew. more dinosaurs are showing up. Um, the speed, all that stuff is kind of working against you. But oh, always easy to just use an Allosaurus, and again. We are moving at hyper speed now. So once I uh, once I lose all my life here, we'll we'll head back to the main screen where we can actually use these keys um, to like unlock dinosaur crates. And that's sort of like the end game of this uh, endless runner is you're always unlocking things. I don't know if that means you unlock them. Oh dang! I don't know if that means you unlock them like to look at them as you drive. Like right now. I, oh, there you go. Um, so yeah, we'll just head back to the main menu here and um, we'll show you how these keys sort of work into the game. Um, so you can see all these different crates here. You click on them and you can unlock some dinosaurs like I'm doing here. I mean, it goes all the way back. Lots of crates are really expensive crates back here. I don't even have enough coins. I'll get one of these 1,000. Oh, Pyroraptor. So um, yeah, I mean, you basically are just unlocking these dinosaurs. I again, I don't know if you see them in the game or if it's just sort of a, a challenge of to get these trophies, basically. But the key game is, you know, lots of fun, and um, it's it's fun to go back and play over and over again. So um, I hope I've done it justice, sort of showing you how it works. Again, I think it's pretty fun myself. Um, you know, I, again, I like Endless Runner games, so um, I think this one is... Uh, a, well done so um and definitely interesting that it's only showing epic evolution stuff too so definitely check it out if you have a phone grab that jurassic world play app and uh, let me know what you think but i think that's all i got for this video again i'm tim with collect jurassic thanks for watching and i'll see you next time